Well, this is a peach tree that's five years old and it's got um, a lot of growth up in the top of it. And all of the growth that you see that is reddish in color, and this one here as well, this is the stuff that grew last year. And this is the wood that will put fruit on it for this year coming. And I've actually, it's, you, what you do is you have to prune them this time of year so that you, uh, one, you don't get too much weight on the trees. And the, the fruit itself is actually a stress on the tree. So you sort of have to balance how much of a crop you want by how much stress you're gonna put on the tree. trees to be about eight or nine feet tall and right now they're probably oh they're probably a good 10 or 12 feet some of them I was going to use this thing and a pair of loppers but it's the trouble is with the loppers that you have to you end up having to reach out you know, too far you know get everything you need and then then you have to you have to you can't get to the other side of the tree This is where I, what I've got, gotten so far. Um, the bulk of all this stuff is just off of a, it's a New Holland 451 uh, sickle bar mower. You know, most farms have a, you know, one or two of these things laying around that they probably used back in the dark ages. We had three of them and this was a junk one. So um, I'll show you what an original one looks like over here and how I kind of modified it. Um, Let's see, this is, um, this goes on the back of a tractor. It's just a you know, regular sickle bar mower. And then of course it's driven by the PTO shaft from the back of the tractor. And then what I ended up doing is just cutting, cutting all this off, the, the belt drive part of it, and then putting a hydraulic motor in here. And then um, because I wanted to have the, it be on the front of the tractor, of the front of the tractor on the loader, um, you know, it obviously has to run this way, so I, I just unbolted this, the whole U-shaped yoke thing that, clamp, that, uh, it's, that carries it all, and then just reversed it so it was pointing the other way. Okay, now. All right. Okay, well anyway, here you can kind of see how this works. Um, it was a little bit complicated to get this thing worked out. This is actually the old suspension off you know when you pick up the the sickle bar it'll you know it picks it up here as well Actually, the loader's I think just about all the way up now, and I'm at uh, I'm at 10 feet right now. So it, you know, it's plenty high for getting the uh, tops of peach trees. We can, we can go up in the orchard and we can cut a few tops of the trees down and see how it works. This is the uh, first time I've ever used this thing. I would sort of. It's actually not exactly finished all the way, but anyway, we're gonna try it out and see what it does. So I'm pretty curious to see if it's gonna work out. Let's see what it does. 